Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today we are starting the day together and I am going to walk you through my current morning skincare routine. I've been using a lot of my favorite multitasking products. Don't mind the poodle back there. They really help me keep things nice and streamlined in the morning. Now, don't get me wrong, 2024 is definitely the year of skin. I am focusing on being really consistent with my skincare, but I love products that target multiple issues at the same time. You get the biggest bang for your buck. I don't always have a ton of time in the morning and I also usually do a full face of makeup so I don't like to layer too many products as well. I think a handful of the right products is really the way to go. And a lot of these I've been using for a long time so no real surprises here today. And today's video is sponsored by Sephora at Kohl's so that is where you will find my entire routine. And I will make sure I link all of these products down below in the description box so you can check them out. I've already done step one, which is arguably one of the most important steps, and that is to cleanse your face. I like to cleanse in the morning and in the evening. I know some people don't like to use a cleanser in the mornings. So they just like to rinse their face with some warm water. I really slather my face with skincare in the evenings before bed, so when I wake up in the morning, it still feels nice and bouncy, a bit balmy. And while I haven't really had many breakouts recently, I still would consider my skin to be somewhat breakout prone so I do like to use a cleanser in the morning just to really clean my skin make sure I'm starting with a fresh face and I've completely degreased everything before I go in with new skincare this youth to the people superfood cleanser is perfect it checks all of the boxes I've been using this for months and months and months now this is actually my third bottle in a row and I use it morning and night even though I use it twice a day it lasts such a long time because you really only need a small amount of cleanser to begin with and then also the bottle size is pretty huge. When you go to restock, you can hold on to the nozzle and just pop it into your next glass bottle of cleanser. And even the box that it comes in is recyclable, which I think is really cool. But it has vitamin C, vitamin E, antioxidants, it helps to balance the pH of the skin. So it has other really great things in the formula. It's not just giving you a really deep cleanse. That is the true reason I love this cleanser. It just wipes everything away, gets rid of any dirt, debris, excess makeup. You know, sometimes in the mornings, I still have a little makeup. It just gets trapped in the hairline or maybe around my neck. So this gets rid of everything in the morning and it feels so amazing. In the new year, I've set a goal for myself to be really consistent with my prep step after cleanser, but before moisturizers and serums. So my new step two is to be diligent with toners, essences, and in some cases, my Dr. Dennis Gross peel pads. This is another longtime favorite product that I have literally been using for years and years. I think a lot of us have. And what's great about these peel pads, I think the reason why people stick with them or maybe they take a break, but they always end up going back to them is that they truly work. I did use a little sunless tanner on my face a couple days ago, so I have a little color. This will probably get rid of some of that, but I don't know if it was the sunless tanner or what, but I did have a little tiny breakout on my chin because of it. These pads are amazing anytime you have a little breakout, if you have texture, if you have hyperpigmentation. I have the Extra Strength Daily Peels. They're also available in Universal. They have a gentle daily peel, so there is something for all skin types. The Extra Strength was actually recommended to me by Dr. Dennis Gross himself. When Dr. Dennis Gross makes a recommendation, I don't question it, and he was right. My skin works great with these. The first treatment is to exfoliate and smooth the skin. It has glycolic acid and mandelic acid and salicylic acid. If my skin is feeling really dry and irritated, I'll skip. But for the most part, I use these once a day, either in the morning or in the evening. I like using them in the morning because they really do help shrink the appearance of my pores. So I feel like my makeup goes on really smooth afterwards. I always give my chin a nice scrub because this is where I get little clogged pores every once in a while. And they're not just amazing for the face, they're also great for your neck, your chest, the back of your hands. You can use them on the body as well. Even though these are the extra strength pads, they are meant to be used every single day, so you shouldn't be intimidated by them. I don't want to waste any of the liquid, so I'm just going to keep going until this pad is dry. I, of course, do the neck, the chest. 
I've been guilty in the past of completely disregarding step two, but something else I learned from Dr. Dennis Gross is that you cannot skip this step. This is why they both come together. You have to use step one and then wait two minutes, go in with step two. So don't skip this step. And this is really cooling and refreshing anyways. This part feels really nice but it helps to restore that balance back to the skin. The second treatment is called the Anti-Aging Neutralizer. It has Reservatrol and green tea extract, so it's going to help support the skin cells and fight against free radical damage. I had to move the camera in a little closer so you can see this glow. My skin looks so smooth and shiny. Everything is nice and tight. Pores are no longer visible. And the texture just feels so smooth. This is the power and the magic of the peel pads. This is why it is worth doing them every single day and being consistent. I'm not super picky when it comes to moisturizer. I have several that I really love, but I'm kind of always open to trying new things. And this one is relatively new. I've been using this for the last few weeks. It's from Tatcha. This is the Dewy Skin Cream. You're probably familiar with it. It has rave reviews. I was just shopping around my local Sephora at Kohl's when I saw this and I know I've heard so many great things about it. So I quickly looked it up and it had so many five-star reviews. So I just sat there for a second kind of scrolling through and reading what people had to say about it. A lot of people love this cream and I had never tried it before. I do really like that it comes with the spatula right here on top. You can see just by looking at it, the texture is pretty thick and I like a moisturizer like that, especially if I'm going in with my peel pads. It has hyaluronic acid, an algae blend, antioxidant, so it's meant to plump and hydrate the skin. This texture feels so nice on the skin. It feels really smoothing and plumping. Like it's penetrating to the deepest layer of the skin. I love it. My face feels plump and bouncy, and you can see it leaves a little bit of a sheen, a little reflection to the skin, but it's not greasy and it doesn't feel heavy. Everything just looks really smooth and glassy. This was another great Sephora at Kohl's find last year. This is the Ulla Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. I swear I was just shopping around when I saw these products. And they do have a really great selection of skincare. They have something for every skin type. They carry all the classics like the Dr. Dennis Gross peel pads, but then they also have any new hot trending products as well. Like this eye cream I know went viral. It has vitamin C and collagen, and when you look closely, it has a very light yellowy tinge, which helps to brighten the under eye. So not only is it really hydrating and smooth, and you have the great ingredients, it's also going to help brighten. And finally, we're gonna add some SPF because of course we have to protect our skin after we did all of that beautiful skincare. This is the number one most important thing we can do every single day. And I said in 2024, we're taking our skincare seriously. I love an SPF with a tint. So this is the Peter Thomas Roth Max Mineral Tinted Sunscreen. It has broad spectrum SPF 45, and it's a light cream. It almost feels like a whipped cream texture. I really like this one because it also has vitamin C and E in it. We're getting our sun protection, but it's also going to help get rid of any redness and even out our skin tone. One of my favorite things about this SPF is that it does not smell at all. You know, sometimes sunscreens have a bit of a chemical smell. This doesn't really smell like anything at all, and I like that it combats the redness on my face. So. It makes me want to use it every single day. I wanted to film in natural light so you could see all of the sunlight in this room. And the sun has been going in and out, in and out all day, but now it's kind of cloudy. We haven't had much sun in Miami. That's about it. My skin is now looking very hydrated, even protected, most importantly. So I'm gonna go throw on a light makeup for the day and I'll be back. I came downstairs for better lighting and you can see what my skin looked like before with just my skincare and now this is with a no makeup makeup look. I love that I can still see my skin shining through. It's very natural. I'm not hiding behind my foundation. And I think that's really a testament to how well this routine has been working for me lately. I didn't realize I was almost out of two things. So pretty soon I am going to have to restock my Youth to the People Superfoods Cleanser as well as my Dr. Dennis Gross Peel Pads. 
So for now, I'm adding those two products to my ongoing wish list. We've been talking a lot about making smart beauty purchases in 2024, and part of that is choosing the right products for our skin, but it's also where you shop. One of the reasons why I love shopping my Sephora favorites through Kohl's is their loyalty program. You earn beauty insider points as well as Kohl's rewards, so all of the dollars that you're spending on beauty products go even further. There really is no excuse not to sign up. It is the best loyalty program. I am very spoiled in South Florida because we actually have two Sephora at Kohl's locations nearby and they're both incredible. I've shopped at both of them. And of course you always have online as well. Definitely worth checking out, especially if you are going on a skincare journey as well this year. I'm now ready for the day, so that completes today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Leave me your comments, questions down below. As always, I will be linking everything mentioned. Everything on my face will be down below in the description box for your convenience. And for more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.